excuses, I am not buying it. You are awesome, and I am JD's. How's it going, chaps? We are back with more NBA Live Mobile. I do apologize for not uploading the past two days. Really just got busy and was not able to record for you guys. I know you were all eagerly awaiting videos. Our uh, Bronze Tour League will be coming out tomorrow. Uh, so definitely stay tuned for that. And I will be restarting my uh, quick sell pack and plays. I know I've been kind of lacking on those with all the player reviews and everything like that. But I, another request came in for a player review. And I'm sorry, I've been trying to find the comment that uh, actually uh, asked for this review here. But I literally could not find it in the sea of comments. And you guys are a very chatty bunch. And I love talking to you guys. I was trying to find your comment to give you a shout out for um, suggesting that I review this 89 overall. Steve Francis, but I'm sorry I could not find the comments. So we've got a nice shooting lineup uh, matchup here with the 90 overall Steph Curry. You see, they're pretty much equal, except um, of course outside of Steph's 97 three pointer. But Steve Francis actually has better shooting than Steph, and Steph's only got three more passing, uh, only one less defense, and only uh, eight less shooting. So they're really kind of even outside of that three point shot. And Steve Francis has got five more speed than Steph. So we should be able uh, to win this matchup here. We should be able to win a matchup against Steph. So let's hop into this and see if we can. Alrighty, diving into it, chaps. Let's see here. Steve Francis. Too bad we didn't have Yao Ming to go along with him. Let's see how this jumper is at first. Let's see. 77 three pointer. So he's not going to be too, too crazily consistent from three. Uh, but his mid range games is going to be very, very nice here. And looking at his defense, we're trying to stay in front of Steph right now. Steph's getting back, but Mello with a nice defense there. Call Mello Anthony. So we will, of course, we've got to test out a three at some point. There we go. Oh, what is he doing? I hate when that happens. I literally hate when that happens. But Steve Francis is going to knock that down, and we will take it. I try to stop for a three, and I go to shoot. Francis with the steal. Um, his passing rating is uh, all right, so he should be able to pass it well. Perfect release, and he's going to knock down the three right in Steph Curry's face. And very nice. We're liking him so far. So far, he is looking good. I could have swore I had him at one point, but I really can't remember. Maybe I didn't. I thought I had Steve Francis way before I had got the 89 Curry, as we're going to pull another three. Kind of contested, but Steve Francis is going to knock it down. All righty, Steve. He said 77 three-pointer, no problem, because he's got great shooting. Good defense there. Because he's got great shooting, that really is what uh, kind of helps it out. Um, that uh, Oh, oh, get to the lane. Get to the lane. Oh, takes the contact, and he's going to lay that one in. Wow. That was kind of outside from the rim. I really didn't expect him to make that, but Steve Francis is looking nice so far, isn't he? Uh oh, get Steph, get Steph, and no! I couldn't pull Howard over there quick enough. Let's see if we can catch him off guard here. Let's see, spin, oh, no, nope, no, nope. it looks like he's gonna lose it, no. Oh, fade away, fade away, perfect release, Steve Francis! All righty, man, this card's amazing! All righty, man, he's looking really good. Shots nice, three's looking consistent. Uh, I'm liking that. Okay, Mello with the nice rebound here. All right, get it back to Steve. Let's see. Can we get the alley-oop? Are you going to go through? I want to see his passing. Uh, really, like you said, you guys have seen it. Oh, there it is. There it is right there to Wayne Wade. But you guys have seen it. If you watch the bronze to elite, we throw alley-oops with the bronze cards. And those guys, really, if it's set up right, I don't think really uh, passing matters when it comes to throwing those oops. He's going to get his own rebound there. And Kevin Durant's going to flip it back in. But my our bronze guys really do a great job of throwing oops as long as they are set up. Perfect, oh, it's first miss right there. But he scored 16 points this quarter. That's really, really good. That is, that is absolutely amazing. 16 points from Steve, one three missed. Not too bad, let's see how he does in the next one. Everybody is just bolstering their big man lineup and it's just looking great. Hopefully they bring up some more variety now because now we're seeing the same defense, we're seeing the same big man lineups every time now we see Ross, Clyde, uh, Carmelo Anthony, uh, Kevin McCall, and Juggernaut Shaq. So if we look, at, uh, of course, Russell Westbrook's going to blow him away. But he's only got seven more speed, only one more dribbling. He's only got three more three-pointer. And of, uh, he's got a fair bit more shooting at 97. Uh, the defense, he's got 16 more defense. And he has nine more passing. So obviously, Ross is the better player, 95 overall. But I believe Steve can get the best of it. All right, chaps, let's see what Steve's going to do against master, NBA master, Russell Westbrook. We're going to, oh, Russell's not even guarding him. 
Ross is not even guarding him, and Steve Francis is going to start off with a nice three-pointer there, all right? We need to see a Steve Francis dunk, though, don't we? We can't go without seeing some Steve Francis high-flying. Nice fadeaway there from McHale, and he's breaking the game. Kevin McHale is literally breaking the game right now. So let's see if we can get him into the lane here. Let's see. Oh, Steve Francis taking the contact. No, he's not going to make that, though. Pretty stout defense. This is a gorgeous lineup we are going up against. Beautiful pass there from Mello. Wow, right to McHale. Kevin McHale, I'm telling you, Kevin McHale is so good. He is so good. Let's see, Steve. Oh, Steve wants a three. Steve wants a three. Steve Francis again. We've got to try to get the lane, but wow, I, I, I have to admit, I am rather afraid of Shaq and McHale in there together. They are just a really daunting bunch in there, as he's finally going to miss a shot there. Let's see where Steve. There he is. That's Wade. That's Wade. That's the Wayne. Let's get over here. Oh, if I throw from there, he was going to steal that. Pump fake. Nope, he's not going to fall for it. He's not going to fall for the pump fake. Spin move. Get to the lane. Okay. Oh, he's going to lay that one in. I really thought he was going to go for a dunk, but hey, we'll take the lay in. We want to see how this man does at the rim, whether it's dunking. Good defense there on Russ. Because Russ literally had a free lane there. Good D. Boy, Steve Francis there. Wade, come on, guys. Get it back to him. Get it back to the man. There he is. There he is. Let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can work on Westbrook here. See if we can get ourselves to the lane. And there we go. Look at Steve Francis. 92 speed versus 99 speed. But you've got to have them handles to get past a guy like Russell Westbrook. So Westbrook's looking to work it. Gives it to Shaq. Over to Clyde the Glide Trexler. And he shows you why. That is his nickname. They show you why right there. Uh-oh. Uh oh Steve. Oh, going up against. I think that was Mikhail. Going up against him, oh my. That is not an easy thing to do. That is not easy at all to go up against Kevin McHale in the lane. Francis with the rebound there. Looking good so far. Spin move, oh, can we get to the lane? Oh, no, we're gonna flip that in, yes he is. Yes he is, no dunks quite yet. No dunks, got we wanna get one more shot with him. Is Russ gonna take, yeah, Russ is gonna take his three. There was no stopping him from taking that. So it looks like we're gonna have one more shot with Mr. Um, Steve Francis here, so here we go. Let's see, he hit a clutch three-pointer. Let's see if we can hit one of our own. Two, one, Steve Francis from deep. Oh no, if it was a perfect release, we might have done it. If we were a little bit closer to the three-point line, he might have made that, but let's see if we can't get a dunk with this man. Alrighty, so we found ourselves a nice 89 overall defensive lineup. Uh, of course, he's got Curry here, so it's kind of much, pretty much the same, really. Kind of really much the same uh, as the uh, 90 overall stuff there. But he's got Clay Thompson, Scotty Pippen, he's got Bolloween, Anthony Davis, and Throwback Thursday, Tyson Chandler. So the defense is going to be quite daunting inside the lane. Alright, this will be a true test for Mr. Francis. Let's just run straight at the rim. There we go, spinning past everyone. He said, no, I'm gonna attack before you have time to set up. He's just attacking, not even worried about it. He said, Bolloween, who? Oh my gosh, why do we have such a hard time stopping Steph Curry? I mean, really? We have such a hard time against this man, and it's ridiculous going up against Anthony Davis. I expect him to lose that one. I expected him to lose that battle there. Anthony did get the best of him, and oh wow, he's on the other side there. I thought he was going up for the jam, but nope, he's going to miss that one. So let's try to preserve a little time here. And uh, no, he, we are not getting in this lane at all. They do not want us in the lane at all, do they? They were about to send over the Anthony Davis double team, and Steve Francis is going to make Steph Curry fall. Oh my, what? That is the first time I've ever done that to someone. I've seen so many people do- oh, what? Where's the charge? Where is the charge? That is the first time I have ever done that to somebody. I have been trying and trying and Steve Francis finally pulls it off for us. Oh my. Steph Curry just hits the deck out of nowhere. Oh, once again. Can we do it one more time? Oh, Steve! Oh, okay. He is not dunking, but he is getting to the lane and he is doing an amazing job right now. I still- I am like so hyped from that. I really can't believe Steph fell. Oh my, Davis, he's got it, oh, good defense, there we go, push the break, push the break, go, that, that's the slowest break push I've ever seen, oh, I want to, oh, I want to dunk so bad with Steve, I want to get this dunk so bad with him, let's see, get to the lane, nope, nope, contact, can he flip it in, yes he can, his contact shot is pretty good, he's missed a few, but his contact shot is pretty good, 
I mean, anyone going up against a Bullowing Anthony Davis or Tyson Chandler, he got you know, amazing defense. Kawhi Leonard, amazing defense as Curry's going to pull his first three and he's going to miss that one there. Let's see, Steve Francis. Can you go with Tyson Chandler? Oh, he's going to go past both of them. Chandler and Anthony Davis. And he's going to get into the lane. Oh, my. I really, really enjoy. Oh, my. Oh, Steph Curry. When can we get one dunk, please? We need at least one. One with Steve. One. No, they're not letting me into the lane. But, of course, they're not supposed to let me in the lane. Oh, but Steve's going to take that. He's going to make that. Okay. I tried to get a, a, a layup animation going to the hoop. But Steve is going to pull that jumper and knock it down. Three, so no dunks with Steve at all, though. No dunks with the man, but you know what? He's played really well. He has played absolutely fantastic. And I really can't ask for more than that. So all in all, this Steve Francis is really a really good card. He's a really... And I know that I say that about a lot of cards, but when you really get down to it and you play with them and you test them out and you do everything you can with them, because that's the best way to test out a card is to try to see what they can do, what they can't do. His contact shot, when faced with a little bit better defensive player, he struggles a bit, but he went up against Kevin McHale. He, he made it. You know, following Anthony Davis, he missed it. We, should, we didn't get a lot uh, of, of those uh, shots in the paint and uh, little contacts, but he's gotten past a lot of really good defenders, and that speed really does help, so I, I really like this card. I've definitely really, really had a good time using this card. His shooting does help out his three-pointer a lot. Like, I always, I always say that every time, because I don't think a lot of people understand that if your guy has a higher shooting, you know, he will, and his three's not that high, his shooting rating will actually help out that three-point rating. So 79 three-pointer with an 89 shooting, he definitely is pretty consistent from three. Made all but one, but was knocking down them pretty pretty well. And he's got pretty decent defense at 70, uh, 69 obviously, but with the boost. Uh, you know, 70 defense, really, really nice. Um, good passing, but like I said, passing, I don't know where that comes into play, because the bronze cards and the bronze elite series we throw alley-oops and those guys throw it beautifully and they have terrible passing some of them like 20 30 passing and they're still like connecting as long as you set up the alley-oop perfectly um i think anyone can throw it so passing i don't really know where that comes into play yet uh, but it's dribbling really good we made steph curry fall i still cannot believe that he fell that was amazing to see and um, but yeah i really really like the card steve francis you know second overall pick in 1999, uh, by the Vancouver Grizzlies, then traded to the Houston Rockets, also played with the Magic and played with the Knicks before going back to Houston for another year. So, Steve Francis definitely enjoyed playing with you. I know you'll never watch this video, Steve Francis, but really enjoyed playing with your card here. It was absolutely amazing. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you played with the Steve Francis before, let me know how you liked him and whether you kept him on your team or whether you probably had the 90 overall Steph Curry by right now. But guys, I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, a thumbs up would be super appreciated. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And as always, chaps, you are awesome. And I am Jay Diesel. See you around.